Sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Baby. Hello, good morning guys. Today I'm gonna to be vlogging. I'm not gonna tell you what day it is because I have a bad habit of not editing vlogs in time, so I don't want y'all to see how bad it is. And my cat is trying to attack me. Okay, so today I'm going to a doctor. I went to a doctor the other day, the um eye doctor, and I got my prescription for my glasses, even though I don't need glasses. Um, and I'm gonna take my sister to get her um eyes checked because she actually wears glasses and she just did that every year. And then I signed us up for a knitting class. So I, so I told y'all before in one of my videos that I don't know how to knit and I really want to learn. And it was really like frustrating for me to learn. Um, so I signed us up for a knitting class. I'm just gonna take y'all along throughout my day. But I'm gonna show you how my hair real quick. So I'm gonna do a separate, I'm gonna do a separate video on my, on this hair box. wax in my hair and the color is fine it's just that the wax gets everywhere so when i touch my hair there's pink on my hands and i don't like that but anyway time to go got a blast all right i'm wearing basic sweat suit for walmart and a tote a canvas tote get some breakfast from Wendy's. I'm gonna get a croissant, egg and cheese, because their croissants are really good. And, oh, there's seasoned potatoes also. And, should I get coffee? Or get lemonade. How's your cat hair on this? And I just, I just started wearing this. Um, do you have the, uh, doll the dollar um, breakfast sandwich? Breakfast is over. We're serving lunch. I know we do not have it that much. Breakfast is over? What time breakfast is over? 10.30. What the? Oh, no. All right, bye. What the hell? How are your breakfast over at 10.30? At least wait till 11. You have a I should do breakfast. I didn't eat breakfast at home because I really wanted a Wendy's breakfast sandwich. Alright y'all, so we're done with the doctor and we make our food. We went to a Trini's place and I'll show you what I got. I got doubles. I mean it's not doubles. I got Polori. What? And I got two doubles. And then I got an egg and cheese. I'm gonna put it for and then we're trying this pineapple Arizona. I never had this flavor before. So let's see. Like the most artificial pineapple you could ever taste. I mean, doubles with tamarind sauce.
Yeah. And then you have to put it back. And I never been embraced. And the money's hard to make. So I bet they on their face right now. When he tell the story, that's not how I went. Know they be lying 100%. Moved out of the wrist and forgot about the bed. Why they just call me to tell me, come get it. Now that boy off and I do want no credit. If it was me, they wouldn't regret it. Let me be dead and now they won't edit it. Artists still get it, my niggas still eat it. They kill the little and the partner eat it. Little talk with them, spilling the tea. And they try to get back and say she didn't mean it. It's hard to believe it. I know that they had the crib. Okay guys, so I'm home from the dang class. It was pretty good. How to talk to knit Pearl. She said she usually just teach how to cast on a knit, but like I got to teach how to pearl and cast off because I asked and yeah. I'm going to be trying to like knit a scarf. I think I might cast on today for a scarf because I have like a lot of acrylic yarn I'm trying to get rid of. And I just want to make like a nice like scrappy scarf for yarn. So um yeah, a scarf is just one long rectangle. So it shouldn't be that hard. But yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. But um I'm gonna wash my hair out today because it's just annoying. Alright guys, so guess what my favorite color is, cuz guess. Take a while, guess what my favorite color is. <laughs> Clearly, it's green. But yeah, I washed my hair. I honestly took forever for that pink wax to get out of my hair. And I'm sure there's still more in my hair. But I was like, I can't wash my hair any more times today. Like, I just washed it so much. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have a separate video on my whole experience with that. But I have crochet projects to finish. Should I finish them or should I should I cast on a, a scarf? Should I? I never thought I would be that like crochet or, or, or knitter. That's like, let me cast on another project when I have like 12 other projects that I didn't finish. I mean, I only have two projects that I'm working on right now. And I got a knitting machine for Christmas too. The Central. I'm gonna start making hats. Oh my gosh, so my projects. my cat is yelling i'm gonna i'm gonna cast on that that scarf okay we're gonna cast that on together i'm gonna show y'all the the colors that i'm trying to do for my scarf so we just have this basic white i have no idea what these brands are this i don't know how this wrapped up like this somebody must have undo i think my sister was using this and she undid it and she wrapped it back up like this because it looks crazy but so there's some white we have this orangey yellow but i don't know what color this is but it's a color um we have this red this is not even used but this is chunky i have some more red i have i don't like the color red like that to wear <laughs> so i don't know why i have so much red but i have this skin of red which is the carson simply soft and then this is the um craft smart and i still have another one skin of red that's don't have a label on it so i have all these red and i don't like red is not my color but for this um i'm going to use like a chunkier yarn like that's softer so it's smaller but this more matches the weight of the other yarns so that's the color i have and this blue and this pink i love pink. like pink is becoming my favorite color like y'all see i like green but like pink is like it's, it's getting up there i don't know i'm kind of obsessed yeah i i just had pink in my hair like i'm you know, so, um, yeah, I want to just make like a scrappy thing with these colors and a neutral, um, I'm just gonna have to use this white. Let me show y'all the, the, um, the swatch that I did in the class. This is a swatch, so I did like the garter stitch and then I tried to stack in it and on top I did like a one row of ribbing and then I cast it off. So this is what we got done today in that class okay um it was it was a good class like um i learned a lot 
we cast on learned all like we learned all of this in one class um mostly because i feel like we we we, we crochet already so it's easier to i don't know if easier or harder to learn but like we knew i don't know I, I think it's easier to learn a new craft when you already know one craft especially like linen crochet like you know you already know it and i practiced a little before with knitting just by from the internet so um i kind of got the hang of it so the instructor taught us how to cast on like by knitting there's like different ways to cast on um that i've seen like some people they just do like some hand thing and they just like cast it on i don't know i'm not as a long tail cast on but like you have to pull out a good amount of yarn to do that and then it's like what if i didn't put pull out enough yarn Ow. just stop my titty ouch that hurt that actually really hurt okay <laughs> anyway slip knot um let me see if i remember budget nuggets um do i remember okay okay so um i think i remember it's just What the hell? Okay. My hands are so ashy. I'm sorry. I just washed my hair and I didn't put lotion on my hands. I'm not going to put lotion on my hands either. Y'all going to have to see my ashy hands. Sorry. But, um, wow, that's so freaking ashy. Key. <laughs> Ciao. Let me get some lotion. All right. <laughs> I'm back with lotion hands. Wait. Anyway, let me. Um, As I was saying, what was I saying? Yeah, I want to go. I want to like take um another couple classes with her and stuff like that. But I want to do the scarf first, see how I do. And it's like I don't have like a regular schedule. Every week I get a new schedule, so I don't know what day I'm off. So one day if I'm off like a Thursday, another Thursday or something, I'll go back um with Kaylin. But yeah. I want to like actually like do my scarf finish it and come back and show her and be like i finished a scarf i did it and then like bring a project to her that i want to actually do me like a pattern or something be like oh i want to make this like i'm gonna have to use patterns <laughs> unfortunately like for knitting like garments because i don't really know i don't want to have to calculate the gauge and stuff i mean i'm not you're supposed to have a swatch to calculate gauge anyway um i guess i'm gonna have to do that but i don't know we'll see oh 40 stitches okay so let's oh i have to i'm doing ribbing okay knit to purl to <laughs> oh gosh let's wrap it off oh fudge I'm messing up already. One. Two. Two knits. And then I bring the string over. I think I'm close to the camera. Yeah, I gotta close that. I bring the string over and then I purl. Right. One. It's just me struggling to do this. Okay. <laughs> what? Why is it? Did I did I cast it on too tight? I don't know. One. Make some space on my desk for my arms. Okay, one. Okay, two. I hear having to count stitches. It's so annoying. One. Okay, this is so. Okay. I'll drop that off there. Okay. Then I put it back here for the knit. Right, then I knit one, two. That's my knit. Now I put it over here for the pearl. Then I pearl 
one. Two. Okay, and I put it here, put it in it. See, this is what I don't like this because I have to like think about it. Okay, I knit two, I purl two, I knit two, I purl two. It's like I don't want to have to think. I like it being mindless. I like like knitting and stuff. Well, not knit, like crocheting when I'm watching something on TV. Um, I mean, once I get used to this, I'm sure like it wouldn't be a problem, but yeah and what i noticed when i was there my shoulders are hurt, started hurting my shoulders are actually just started hurting again now because i guess like i'm using a part of my body that i wasn't using before like it's not the same motions as crocheting it's different like hand motions so i'm using a different part of my body that than i'm usually using so I have to like warm this up because this arm is just, it's my right arm that's um, bothering me. It's like the upper part of this arm and my shoulder is um, actually bothering me. And I don't really know how to fix that. Is it like the way I'm doing it, is it wrong? Or is it like I just have to get used to these motions i guess this like putting the yarn back and forth is freaking annoying okay first row um i'm gonna work up how more i always probably watch blacklist or whatever because my friend christine is watch I mean, she already watched it, but she's rewatching it and she's way ahead of me. And I have to catch up, so I'm going to watch Blacklist while I do this. Oh, my arm. Try to do a couple more rows. Maybe I'll try to finish like the ribbing. I don't know how long, how much rows I want to do. I'm just gonna see what is thick enough. And um, then after that, I'll like switch colors, but maybe I'll just get the ribbon done for this side of the scarf now. Um, and then I'll like finish crocheting what I was doing yesterday. Um, and yeah, to look. All right, y'all. So this is what I got. This is what I got so far. It's coming out well. I'm just, I'm just over it. Like this is, I could knit and I could pearl, but this knit pearl shit. It's. Annoying, so I'm going to give it a break. I literally want it to be like <coughs> maybe like the length of this, and that's a lot of rows. And I really hate doing the knit and then the switching to pearl and then switching to the knit. I really hate it, but it has that's what has to be done to make this um, stitch. And I just like it but um i'm gonna i'm gonna put this away so it's 10 46 um i'm gonna crochet a bit i might go down six guys and eat um i'm really tired so um yeah that's the end of my vlog thank you for watching this video make sure to subscribe and yeah see you next time with the air, in the light. I don't care with the air.